All right, so through our landscape design process, we want to know who is this for and who is it not for. And, and that's not to say that we don't want to work with everybody. We have a way, like if you have a landscape project, we have a bunch of ways that we can work with you. But it just might be a little bit frustrating if you sign up for the paid design with Jesse because it, it does take a little bit of time to sure. flush out the full, by the time we get out to measure, by the time we do uh, meetings, by the time we design it on the computer, we get revisions, all that sort yeah. of thing can stretch it out. But if you already know what you want to do, that might not be the best realm. So maybe let's just talk about like, who is the, our design service for and, and who kind of isn't it for? Yeah, so I think that's a good way to think about it. So. The design service is really for people who have, say, a new yard that has nothing down and needs some ideas, or maybe a yard that's having an overhaul and we're like really changing the footprint of how things are. Um, it's also for people who, like, you might have some ideas of what you want, but you just don't know how they fit together, right? Like, how am I gonna get a fire pit and a pool and a hot tub and a water feature to all kind of sing together? Um, so like, those are your, really really big ones i think yeah and i think like for for people that do have that they're you know they're they're either taking a bomb to an existing yard or they are uh developing something from scratch like there's a lot of moving parts in there and so i think by you know by hiring a professional yeah. you get you jesse's thinking about this stuff all the time right so he knows that he can get to the answer sooner than have you stumble through the process on your own. Um, but I think like if you're doing one of those two things, you definitely need a plan. Whether yep. that's from Jesse, whether that's from another one of the great designers in town, uh, whether that's you coming up with something to scale on your own, um, the bottom line is you need a you need a plan for something like that. But in, in saying that, there's some things that we don't need a plan for. No, no, for sure. So like, say you have a, just a, a project in mind, you want a, a patio and you know where it goes and you know what you want it to look like, you probably don't need a whole yard design. We can get you moving quicker with our project lead. Yeah, um, obviously, obviously we need a plan, but we we need a plan for we need a project plan, a construction plan, yep. and and we can help with that. But it's not through uh, our our two D and three D design process. Exactly. Or I get oftentimes lots of people that just want some planting suggestions or just something for for a few beds out front. And in all honesty, like I can do that for you, but. We're more catering and our, our process is more looking at like full yard kind of design instead of just giving you a few plants at that price point. Yeah, and, and there's there's lots of uh, greenhouses, garden centers, um, uh, other other designers as well that will do just plant consultation, just plant recommendations. So that's probably a better way to go if you're looking just for, for plant stuff. And I would say same thing with, um, you know, hey, I've got this corner of my yard that I'm not sure what to do with. The way to deal with that isn't necessarily through our design process. It's you know take a couple of pictures, send it into us, bring it down to the store, um, come get some ideas, and and we can help you with some ideas, right? Yeah, absolutely. Like every like we live and breathe landscaping at this shop every single day. So if it's not me, there's still plenty of people that have a ton of inspiration to draw from and can even use the shop to show you what to do uh, with some of those areas that you're not sure about. Yeah, and so our end goal isn't to get every single one of you to do a paid design with Jesse. No. Our end goal is to get you uh, to the to the, to the the goal line as, as efficiently as possible, right? So if there is something that you, um, you know, we can, if we can bypass Jesse um, to be able to get you there faster and get enjoying your yard faster um, and allocate some of that budget too. Like yeah. it's, you know, like for, for uh, those smaller projects, sometimes that's better spent on maybe an upgrade in materials or maybe hiring the work done versus uh, doing it yourself or something like that. Yeah, I, I think that's exactly right. We can uh, get you to the, the goal no matter which way you're looking for. Um, sometimes it's just those smaller projects. Let's put that design budget money towards the project itself versus those big yard overhauls and net new yards, we have the opportunity to create you something special from scratch and really go over those details. Yeah, and that's where you really shine, is on those complete yard, uh, either developing or uh, on a on a redevelop. I mean, there's just so much going on. I mean, I look at even, even my yard on the acreage, like, you know, it's kind of embarrassing, but I didn't get a plan yeah. and, and I've moved stuff three times because I didn't see the overarching how it was all going to work together. Like I have, a landscape designer yeah. on staff so but it's like you know you you think you know but until you get it down on paper that's that's uh you're going to be missing something so i think that that really gives you an overview on what the, who the design is for and who it is for. yep